currently we are wasting at least 40% of the food that we produce. I'm Natalia Falagam, I'm a lecturer in food science and technology at Cranfield University. I'm an agricultural engineer by training. So my job has different sides that they are all focused on the same objective, that is reducing the food waste that we have in our supply chain and our systems. This facility is unique in the world. It's nine meters high, but the important part, apart from being able to mimic any growing condition in the world, is that we have a gantry with lots of cameras inside that allow us to monitor very, very specifically the growth of our plants within the glasshouse. The importance here is the data that we can collect and that we will help us make decisions in the future. Currently, we have a growing population that we need to feed. And even though that's something we all know, we are wasting at least 40% of the food that we produce. From my perspective, it's not about keep on producing more and more fruit and vegetables, food, and putting that pressure in our agricultural system. It's about utilizing the food that we already have. We are in the Plant Science Laboratory at Cranfield University where we do our analysis to know if the fruit or vegetable fresh produce is uh, good enough for the consumers. This is an automatic texturometer. What it does is uh, compressing the fruit so it tells us objectively how hard or soft our a specimen is in this case. The, the value that we get, we will compare with the requirements of supermarkets to know if it's feasible to sell it or not. I always wanted to do engineering, but the reason why I wanted to go for agricultural engineering is because it puts together two disciplines that are very, very important to me. One is the biology, the natural systems, natural capital, environment, and we need solutions. We need to find solutions, technological solutions, to tackle those challenges that the environment is facing. Yeah. I think the beauty and what I love most about my work is that it allows us to develop technology that make us use those resources better, so we waste less water, we waste less food, fruit and vegetables, food in general. So it's a better use of the resources that we have.